Rain, rain, and more rain. After an unusually dry January and February, Southern California has been pummeled by a series of spring storms in late March and April. But has it been enough to catch us up to normal numbers? It's trying its best. I mean, we're not quite there. Uh, we still need to see more rainfall to kind of get ahead because those two months we missed out on were some of our wettest months. So we're right near where we should be and, and above normal. Eric Bolt from the National Weather Service told CBSN Los Angeles that the recent rain has really made an impact. March was at least an inch and a half to two inches above normal. So that really got us going later in the spring. And then the storm we've recently had pushed us above the normal for the entire month of April. So far in April, downtown Los Angeles has seen more than two inches of rain. That's already nearly an inch and three quarters above what we normally see all month. And while rain is usually a good thing in Southern California, what impact, if any, will the late rain have on fire season? Fire season is a really tricky thing to predict. It really depends on how much wind we see in the fall and the early winter months. But what we really want to be uh, concerned about is that uh, we're going to have more grass uh, growing because of all the rain. And the drought? So what we've seen is that the drought started to get above normal. We start to see uh, quite a bit of dry conditions across the state. Northern California is still a little bit on the drier side, but down here in the southern part of the state, we're, we're pretty much erasing the drought and we're back to a good position at this time. And you know, the latest drought monitor did come out today. I checked it. It looks like we're slowly starting to inch out of this drought now. So all this rain, of course, is a very good thing.